What's up guys? So we got another update video for you. So today we are talking about Ash's Dungeon. That is the, the main thing that came out in the last update. Um, so in terms of little things, just a couple quality of life things, a fix to rots, rot salutes in general are better, a couple decanting fixes, uh, dusk dawn no minions, um, fix one of Espula's am uh, animations, uh, and then increase the chance of superior. So, so nothing major, just a bunch of small stuff, and I'll have this link in the description below if you want to read it. But the main thing is this dungeon. So I'm on my legit account working on that series. You're probably seeing spoilers. I apologize. Uh, I don't think most people care. But if you do care, I guess stop looking. <laughs> so we're, I'm going to gear up. And then I'll, I'll show you how the dungeon works. Okay, so this dungeon, how it works is you basically pay 100 mil to get in. And uh, the monsters in the dungeon are pretty normal. You're, you're in the... There's Abyssal Demons. Let me move this over a little more. Abyssal Demons, Dust Devils, Dark Beasts, Blood Veils, Elf Warriors, and Neck Rattles. Uh, and then Evil Chickens is the last one. So just standard mobs. And they have the same drops that you would expect them to have. But every single monster in here has access to a unique table. Um, and with, that, with this unique table, there are two tiers. One in 50 and one in 100. And these are the loops you can get. Um, so you can get good things like you can get 1 mil, Numulite, 1 mil, Tuckle, Elite Mystery Box... Um, these three shields right here are pretty interesting. Um, the dragon one protects you from all dragon fire, as well as Vorkat's Wrath. The lucky one provides the same luck boost as a lucky amulet, but it's a shield, so that's a new slot for, for luck boosts. Um, and then the last one, the uh, skull, provides a damage boost on Slayer Test, the same as a Slayer Helm, so it's like having an extra Slayer Helm. And then you can pick. Uh, it, it has the ability to assign tasks, um, and then every single monster on that table is found in the dungeon so it can only assign monsters in the dungeon so that's pretty cool um so that's it for the update let's let's jump in there and i'll uh give you a tour i expect to see some people in here i don't know what everybody's killing i want to kill probably dark beast either dark beast or dust devils we'll see if anybody's i guess whichever slayer test i get that's probably the, that's probably the, the way most people probably do it just to be on Slayer Task. I'm going to try to do Dust Devils. So, let me, uh, let's kill some Dust Devils. <laughs> so, I will show you, I'll, I'll resume whenever I, I manage to get a loot that, uh, where's Smoke Devils? Whenever I manage to get a loot that is on the special table. I'm sure I'm going to get this a lot. No, I'm not teleporting anybody back into the dungeon, or if you forgot something, well, it, no. If you want to get back in this dungeon, you got to pay 100 mil. And to prove my commitment to that, I am on Ancients with my High Alks. So, so there. And if I'm not cheating, nobody gets a cheat. Okay, so I cut away to show you guys uh, me getting a loot, just to kind of show you what it looked like. I have not gotten a loot. <laughs> I've, I've gotten one loot, but it was when I was doing something, so I couldn't record it. And I was like, oh, it's cool, I'll just get another one. Um, so I did get the... Oh no, check. I did get the two Master Casket ones, so that's a pretty cool one. Um, as you're looking at my inventory, you're probably like, oh, why are all these weird items in here? Yeah, you can't drop the dungeon at the moment. The reason for it was I didn't want people drop trading, but the more you think about it, I don't think people would drop trade anyways. Uh, for one, it takes five minutes for any item you drop to show up, so it'd be... I just, it, I just don't think it's going to be as big of an issue as I thought it was going to be, and it's more of an inconvenience to people who, like me, loot... <laughs> so yeah, I don't think it's worth the inconvenience of accidentally looting items you don't want. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be fixed probably tonight, by the time you see this video. But uh, yeah, I've, I've been kind of unlucky with the dungeon. I've been sort of... The problem with this dungeon is uh, uh, everyone else seems to be doing just fine. <laughs> like, everyone else seems to be getting really lucky, so I don't want to make any changes to the drop rate yet until I can test it further. It seems like it's pretty much just me that's getting unlucky. Like, there's screenshots... On the disc, let me see if I can find one. I don't know how long he's been here, but here's Iron Xavier's screenshot, and that's pretty much all dropped. So, uh, yeah, it seems like it's just me as being unlucky. I, I was going to try to show you a drop, but uh, yeah, uh, I think I'll just end the video there. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoy it. Um, this is a pretty cool dungeon. I, I wish I had something better to show you myself. I actually have gotten three superiors, so that superior update definitely mattered as well. Um, the superior chance isn't increased in here. I just increased the chance unrelated. So, so yeah, you don't have to come in here for that. You can just go to normal ones. 
And then obviously evil chickens don't even drop a spear. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Come check out the dungeon. And I will see you later. Why am I... See ya. Bye.